Hi everyone, uh, today we will discuss regarding three different tools which are available in AutoCAD draw panel. First one is multiple points, second one is divide, third one is measure. The difference between multiple points and point is, in case of point command, it can be used only once. That means if you select point command, if you invoke point command, it can be used only once. After that again you have to invoke the command and reuse it. That means only one point can be generated at a time. In case of multiple points, once after invoking this command, n number of points can be generated as per your requirement. Let us see how exactly it is going to work out. First we will see point command that is POINT. I just click here, it got terminated. Once after generation of a single point, the command got terminated. Now I will use this multiple points command. I have selected this. I have generated a single point. Again, I am clicking it here. Another point is gener another point uh, got generated. Similarly, I can generate n number of points as per my requirement. So this is the difference between multiple points and then point command. Similarly, we have got two different tools. They are divide and measure. Let us see how they are going to work out. First, we will look into divide command select divide command it will ask for the geometrical entity to be divided strictly speaking it is not going to physically divide the geometrical entity let us see how, how exactly it's going to work out I am selecting the geometrical entity now it will ask for the number of segment I am entering the number of segments as 5 this is open entity that means two ends are not closed they are kept open so that is the reason four points are generated five minus one is four that is the reason four points are generated as shown in the figure one two three four whereas five entities are generated one two three four and then five if you select this it remains a single entity but for pictorial representation this is segmented into five entities Similarly, you can select inclined line also and then vertical line also. It really doesn't matter whether it is horizontal or vertical. Select divide command. Select the object to be divided. Then press enter button. It will ask for the number of segments. Uh, you can provide the number of segments as 10 or 20 as per the requirement. You can see here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 9 points are uh, generated. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 seg segments are generated. Uh, similarly, you can select a closed profile also. Let us see how, how it is going to work out. Go to divide command. Select the entity. It will ask for the number of segments. Select number of segments as 4. 4 points are generated. So that is the difference between uh, closed entity and open entity. If you ask for 5 segments, 4 points would be generated in case of open entity. If you ask for 4 segments, 4 points are generated in case of close, uh, closed geometrical entity. That means number of segments equal to number of points in case of closed a geometrical entity number of points is equal to number of segments minus one in case of open geometrical entity now we will move to another command in AutoCAD that is measure earlier we saw it asked for the number of segments now let us see how it is going to work it will ask for the object so let us select this particular object then press enter it is asking for length of the segment it will not ask for the number of segment instead of this it will ask for the length of the segment once after selecting the geometrical entity AutoCAD will automatically calculate the total length of the geometrical entity now it is asking for the length of the segment total length of the geometrical entity divided by length of the segment will uh, lead to the number of segments let us see this is 100 mm segment now let us calculate 100 mm segment now I am going to divide into I am going to enter the length of each segment as 25 
types of it would be fragmented into four entities so let us select the length of the segment as 25 you can observe here 1 2 3 4 it has been fragmented into four entities it is only for the representation purpose originally it remains as a single entity it is basically for the construction purpose thank you very much do subscribe to the videos keep watching and supporting